Do not cut me off. I might just follow you to the parking lot and cut your ass out. Do not cut me off. And then somebody was like, you know, fuck around, go back there and get shot. And it just made sense. I said, oh shit, I'm putting my life in danger. I said, don't you ever put another. You know the vibes. It's Jay. Hand me the lighter, I'm about to get litter than a bitch. Big, big, period. Are you serious? These hoes are acting all delirious, and I ain't. You know the vibes. What's going on, J Squad? Plum Squad, it's, it's your girl Jay. You already know. Welcome back to J Vibes. With a whole lot of great vibes going on, big, period. Today's video, I ain't about to rant my motherfucking ass off. But before I even get into all of that, you know what I'm saying? Please make sure you are subscribed to my channel. It's not just this one, I have three. Make sure you give this video a like. Make sure you comment down below your love, questions, feedback, all that good shit. Put it in the comment section. Make sure you share this content and make sure you are following me on all my social media. Yeah, all that good shit. Now, what am I ranting about today? I ain't gonna rant about, first of all, before I even rant, let me just tell you why I'm ranting, okay? Work for Amazon. Full time employee. Over 100 hours. A week! Is this a week? Hold on. I said that back. I said that back. Over 100 hours. It don't fucking matter, okay? I work a lot of motherfucking overtime. I work a, a lot. 10 hours a day. A lot. I usually have only one day off a week, okay? You do the motherfucking math. Now, with that being said, it's just a lot of things that be going on that I want to get out of my... <clears throat> Drink some water. With that being said, it's just a lot of things that I want to get out of my chest. And I ain't gonna cap. It's probably gonna be a part two to this thing. I don't know about no part three. Maybe, maybe not. It's just so many levels to this shit, okay? I want to rent about being an, uh, an employee herself. I wanna rant about the the mother, the customers. I wanna rant about the, the job. The company. I just wanna rant. I just wanna get it off my chest, okay? Now, let me just start from where I'm gonna start from. Boom. Let me just start as me going to work. I don't wanna start there. No, yeah I do, yeah I do, yeah I do. I wanna say, why the fuck can we not start earlier in the morning? I don't wanna start in the, in the middle of the morning, almost afternoon, because then I be there, I be out there all night. I wanna start in the early morning. Like FedEx and UPS and post offices and the, they be out there in the streets. I'm trying to be out there in the streets too. All right, now let me, uh, let me just, let me just talk about it, all right? Let me just talk about this one, this one morning when I did go to work, since I'm just talking about going to work. Let me just talk about this one morning when I did go to work. When I went to work one morning, y'all, it wasn't nowhere to park. Nowhere to park near my, near my unit, okay? I'm like, damn. I just gotta find one. When I find one, I just gotta pull in that bitch and just gotta park. So I did that. Why the fuck when I come back to my car, somebody, <sighs> Somebody put a real piece of paper, like a regular size, real piece, not not the fake pieces, not not the really thin pieces, like the printed paper pieces, the real pieces of paper. Somebody put a real long piece of paper on my car and they taped it. You know, they ain't just, you know, tear the tape off and was like, I'ma just tape this corner and tape that corner. No, they put the fucking strip of tape on my car, on my window. <laughs> I was so pissed. I was so pissed. It was hot as fuck that day too. So, you know, the tape is damn near trying to merge and make love to my window. Like making kissy faces on my window and just got all kind of kissy mark dress on water. <coughs> got all kind of like marks on my window when I took the shit off. When I took the shit off, I was like, oh my god, and I'm touching it. And it's sticky as fuck. And I'm like, oh, <clears throat> so so what do I do? I flipped that piece of paper over and I wrote them a note. I said, don't you ever put another piece of paper on my car or tape or I'll tape all these vans. 
and I'm gonna go put it on their van. Because I parked in another company's area, I guess. But where else was I supposed to park? I ain't trying to be late for work. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all, I was so pissed. I was like, yo, I'm going to work early the next day. I'm, sp I'm speaking to whoever put that piece of paper on my car. I'm talking to them directly. I'm talking to my manager like, do y'all got cameras out here? Because I need to know who did that. I had to go home. And damn near watch slash scrub the fuck out of my car. And I couldn't even get that sticky shit out. So I had to call my dad like, yo, come outside. It won't come out. I'm getting mad. You know, Pop said today. He always said today. He got that shit out. So I kind of calmed down. But I still, I still was plotting on the inside. I was like, yo, when I go to the job, when I find out who did it, I'm just going to take I'm gonna have to go buy some tape and I'm gonna just take the whole fucking van. I ain't give a shit. I ain't do it neither because eventually I calmed down. You know what I'm saying? Bae was making me feel stupid about, you know, how I was thinking. She have a way of doing that. She have a way of just, you know what I'm saying, painting out the bigger picture and calming me down. So I was like, okay, you know what? Cool. Dress some water. So I'm like, cool. All right? So since we ran and shit, Let's just talk about it. Let's talk about it. Amazon got all, all this motherfucking money. And when I ask you for another shirt, when I ask you for another vest, when I ask you for some pants, some shorts, when I, mother, when I need some socks, you should be able to provide. I shouldn't have to wait three months for an order to come in. Motherfuckers get that shit the next day when they order on Amazon. When they shit that bitch, they shit that bitch out the next day. You know what I'm talking about? I shouldn't have to wait three months to be in uniform. And then, if you're not in uniform, you know, you, you get you, you gotta hear somebody's mouth about why you're not in uniform, bitch. Y'all ain't provide, well not you, but the company ain't providing uniforms right now. Let's talk about when I'm on the road, when I'm in the Am Amazon truck. And y'all, I used to, Sometimes still do drive the vans, but I'm in that big boy. You know what I'm talking about? Like, you know how you see the FedEx trucks, the box trucks, the I'm in that big shit. Yeah. I'm in that big, I'm in that big bitch. So, y'all, when I'm driving, when y'all see us, this is for, and I'm probably speaking for the FedEx, UPS people, all of them, but I'm just talking about me, because I work for Amazon. Bro, when I'm motherfucking driving, do not cut me off. I have road rage, you guys. Do not cut me off. I might just follow you to the parking lot and cut your ass out. Do not cut me off. Do not cut me off, bro. And then, if you see one of us behind you, get the fuck out the way. Get out the way. I'm on the clock, and I know I'm on the clock, all right? I know I'm getting paid to just sometimes drive slow. Hell no. When you got, when you got almost 200 stops, can you imagine stopping and going and going and stopping and getting out and going? 200 times a motherfucking day, 300 packages, can you imagine? Nah, you have no motherfucking idea. So when I'm behind you, get the fuck out the way. Wave to me, okay? Give me a little snack or two. A bitch is already fully hydrated on water. If it ain't a Gatorade, I don't want it. I'm gonna get to that. Ooh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get to that. Don't you even worry. When I'm riding past you, if I made it difficult for you, to, I don't even know how I can make it difficult because you just ain't got no motherfucking patience. But it's just been a few times when I just been over to the side and I just be as far to the side as I can to not be in nobody grass, to not be in nobody trees, to not hit nobody mailbox. But I'm over to the side and then the motherfucker riding by slow and they just shaking their head. That shit pisses me off. Do not shake your fucking head at me. What the fuck is the problem? Bro, I be trying to figure it out. Like, that shit really bothers me.
me, you know what I'm saying? Like, I had this school bus driver yesterday ride by me. He just shaking his head looking stupid as fuck because he got that ugly ass duck looking mask on and he just shaking his head at me. I said, what? And then I had to remember he had kids in that bitch. And I was like, oh. Lord, take the wheel. All right, this is gonna be my last confession right here. It's gonna be my last one. And this is this is for you guys. This is for you guys who go online, order shit, and then you know that little note session? I don't know, because I don't order on Amazon enough to know. But I don't know how and when y'all put those notes on your account. <laughs> but baby, I don't give a fuck about the note. I don't give a fuck that you want your package at the back door of the side door. I don't give a fuck that you want your package early in the morning. I don't give a shit that you want your... I don't care! You're telling me to call you when I pull up? No! I don't got time for that shit! I don't... Bruh. <laughs> I don't... I don't have time to call you when I pull up. No, I'm not doing that. Because let me tell you something. When I first started this job... I was doing everything right. You want it at the back? I'm going to go to the back. You want me to call you? I'm going to call you. You know what I'm saying? You want it at the side? Then it's at the side. But then, I start hanging around the vets. And I start listening to their stories. And my manager, he the one that told me. He said... I would never go to nobody's back door. He said, so I would never ask you to do nothing that I wouldn't do. And then it made sense. I ain't doing that shit neither. And then he said, you know what I'm saying? You know, just for safety. And then somebody was like, you know, fuck around, go back there and get shot. And it just made sense. So I said, oh shit, I'm putting my life in danger. I ain't going back there neither. So no, I'm not going to your back door because your dog can be back there. You can be back there with a gun. You can be trying to set me up. I ain't going for that shit. So no, I'm not going to your back door. I'm going to put it right there on the front door. And y'all notes. <laughs> when y'all be like, can I get my package early? I'm on vacation. I really need this. This is for a birthday gift. I really need this. But when I start seeing that bitch every fucking time I pull up to your house, I'm like, ain't no fucking way I got a birthday every day. Ain't no motherfucking way. You know what I'm saying? So then I'm, I'm thinking to myself, this shit is cap as fuck and it's a lie. But not only that, I don't see those notes until I get to your package. So when y'all saying, I need this early in the morning and I pull up at 6.30, yeah, I don't give a fuck. And it was out of my control. And I just, I just want y'all to know that we don't see them notes. I don't, I don't even think the warehouse people see the notes. I think the driver is the only person that see the notes, but we don't see the notes until we pull up, okay? And I don't give a fuck about your notes. I don't. And the part that be killing me is the please. I don't give a fuck about your please. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I just want to do my job. I want to get the fuck off, okay? Because I got 178 stops okay i got 315 packages and i'm in these streets from the sun up to the sun down so what uh, <laughs> that wraps up my rant for today because i gotta get ready for it yep i gotta get ready for it but that wraps up my rant i um mm, it's so much more that i have to rant about but you know what i'm saying give this video a like Hit the thumbs up button, you know what I'm saying? Comment down below your questions, your feedback, all that good shit. Put it in the comment section. Make sure you share my content. Follow me on my social media. And make sure you also subscribe to my channels. I'll give you a part two. And that's on Big Period. Hope that you have a great day, a blessed day. Stay clean. Don't get on nobody's nerves. Get out of the way. Go edit your Amazon account notes. Mm-hmm. And, uh, I'm sending that to the next video. Peace. Nah, I ain't conceited I'm a different breed it. Catch you slipping, best belief I don't need no reason I'ma cut the ties, ho Turn your wife to my ho Just focus on you, baby girl <laughs> J-Vibes, you know the vibes You know the fuck going on And I'm out this bitch